All right, today we're going to go over fixing buffering on your device here. So you started getting a little buffering. You've contacted your streaming service and they're saying that their servers are 100% up. So first thing that you want to do is make sure you connect it to the internet. Uh, then you're going to go into your app setting and the settings. If you see, I went to the gear icon, clicked on apps, and then you're going to want to go to the app that you're actually using. If you're using Netflix or any streaming, um, like here I'm using Buck TV, uh, simply go down and clear the cache out. It's just that simple. Uh, I'll actually go through all my, I'll go through another app. I'll go to the My Soy app and clear the cache. And you do it from the app settings and the settings menu. Don't hit clear data. If you hit clear data, it'll erase all your username and password out. You could hit clear data, but just know that you'll have to enter the username and password again if you do. So clear out the cache. Um, the next thing you're going to want to do is run a speed test. I'm just going to go ahead and add the speed test into the main menu real quick. Uh, if you don't have a speed test, you can go on to Google Play or App Toy TV and just do a quick speed test to see what you're running with. I mean, you, if anything below uh, 20 megabytes a second, you're going to have some problems with um, HD or 4K. If, if you look here with this one, the reason why I like this one is because it'll tell you what you can stream. Like it's telling me, okay, I'm good for HD and I'm good for 4K. But it's telling me I shouldn't stream anything in 8K if, if you have those capabilities. Yeah, just my internet's not good enough for it where we're at. Um, upload speed, it's important, but not as important as the download. But as you can see, the upload speed is pretty decent as well. This isn't great speeds. It might be for the U.S. or from where I'm at, you know, sometimes we get close to a gig. But definitely check your uh, internet speed make sure it's over 20 megabytes a second and do it from the app like i just did or do it from the device don't do it from your phone unless you're watching a streaming service from, from the phone once you're done with that i would reset your router literally unplug your device from the outlet unplug the device and unplug your router let it sit for 30 to 40 seconds to a minute sometimes a couple minutes and then plug everything back in I've also downloaded a cleanup app, as you just saw right there, and it basically kills a lot of the apps that are running in the background and cleans some of the cache that is on the system itself. Um, and that's basically it. That, that should clear up about 90% of your buffering problems. If it doesn't, you can always send us an email and you can check some other stuff. Uh, so there's some other guides out there, uh, maybe a video another day, you know, Depending on your device, if you're using an older device, that could be some problems as well. But definitely the first things you want to do is go ahead and clear out the cache and reset your router and device.